Topaz Labs Photo AI will change the way you edit your photographs. I will show you how. Hi, it's Peter here. Most image editing software has some kind of AI built in. And AI is a good thing in general. But we have to remember that do not rely only on AI when you're editing your images. The best way is to make it work for you so that you, your workflow will be a lot, lot faster. But then you get some kind of results but you want to tweak those results to your likings. So do not trust AI 100%. It will make the image like it think it should be. But adding your own input into the edit will make it your image. Topaz Labs has a great set of AI-based image editing software. But the problem has been so far that if you need to upscale your image a bit, need to sharpen it and reduce some noise or any of those do things, you need to use three or two different softwares. And that is a pretty hard thing or not the fastest and most convenient way of image editing. Even though all Topaz Lab software work as a plugin for Lightroom Classic and Photoshop and I think some other softwares do, but I only have experience with Photoshop and Lightroom Classic and Topaz Lab software as plugins. But now Photo AI will make this a lot faster. You can only use one because Photo AI is kind of like a user interface for these three softwares. They work inside from that. And I would suspect that in the future, Photo AI will be the software and they won't be uh, delivering this software separately. I don't know. This is just something that I think is going to happen. So mainly for now, Photo AI is the front end and the user interface for these things. It can make your uh, noise level less. So it denoise, it can sharpen your images and it can also upscale it. And then there is enhancements and also face recovery. And I think this is a very, very good way of editing images. It's not a full image editing suit so far. It only does these things and they are mainly done in global sense so you do not I didn't I actually didn't find anything or any way to mask the image so that it could only do in certain parts and speaking of masks mask AI used to be also a software from Topaz Labs but they don't sell it anymore of course if you have it it still works but I don't think they're gonna sell it anymore but what I think is that they will add this to photo AI in the future. So it will become more usable and it will have a lot more features in the future. That is only something that I predict and would probably be a wise thing to do. So it is going to the same, di same direction as Luminar has gone with their AI and Neo software, which I think is a good direction. I still will be using Lightroom and will use these AI based softwares as plugins and do certain things if I want to. For example, denoising is something that I like to do in other softwares. And with photo AI, I can, you know, make the sharpening and, and maybe upscaling too at the same time. And let's see how it works. You open up the image and you have the tools on the right. And it will have autopilot settings defaulted on. And usually what it does is denoising. And then you can add the other uh, things that if you want to do some more image editing. But if you only need, let's say, denoising, then you don't need photo AI, you can use the denoise, at least so far. And you can always tweak the results by these sliders. So the amount that you want to do, for example, denoising can be adjusted. And like I said, do not trust AI as it is. Always do your own fine tuning. Topaz photo AI is in beta version now, and it will be released in September 2022. If you want to test it, you need to have Gigapixel Denoise and Sharpen AI uh, combo bought and activated. Then your Topaz Labs account will show the photo AI and you can download it and use it as a beta version. But remember, it is still in beta. There might be some bugs or, or some features might be uh, working a bit oddly. I didn't find any, any odd things, but there might be. I would suspect that if you use the beta version, you will get photo AI full version. But this is just something that I think is going to happen. I don't know. But in the future, you can buy Photo AI. And if you want to test it now, you need to get those three softwares, which I have an affiliate link in the description of this video. And if you buy something 
I will get a small commission, and but you don't pay any extra. So it's a win-win situation. You support my channel and you get some good piece of software. But like I said, I think Topaz Labs has gone to the right direction by combining the softwares and, and mainly making the workflow a lot, lot easier. And I don't know if I already mentioned that Photo AI works as a plugin for Lightroom Classic and Photoshop. And it also works as a standalone software. And here are some more videos about Tobas Lab software if you're interested in those. But hey, thanks for watching and bye for now.